Hi guys, I'm Ed, the welder at Project Heaven, and today I'm going to be talking you through um, the set of doors, boot and bonnet that we're doing for an XJS V12. The customer, he came to us, you may have seen in previous videos of his Jag. Um, they're quite heavy cars, so he wanted as much weight saving as possible. So we've gone for aluminium skins on the doors, boot lid and the bonnet. Um, this one I've already made. The original doors weighed around 25 kilos. And now what we've done here with a 1.2 mil aluminium skin and on the back of the door, we have drilled and dimple dyed to take some extra weight out of the steel as well. So to make the aluminium skin, the process of, I took the original door, made a cardboard template, roughly of the size, um, cut the aluminium sheet using the shears for the curves and the guillotine for the straight edges. Um, this door is only a one-way curve, so it's quite easy and it didn't need any English wheeling. So I've sent it through the slip rollers to get this curve and it's got a different radius curve on the top of the door. So I've rolled them two separately and put it in the box folder to get the swage line to match up with the body. So at the front of the door, we have the wing mirror and at the back, we have the door handle itself. But the aluminium isn't as strong as steel. So I've had to spot weld in a reinforcing plate behind it. Just to show you how much weight we are saving by skinning the doors in aluminium and drilling out and dimple dyeing the, the steel frames. I've got the original door here with no window in it, window mechanism, and it's got the original crash bar crash protection inside it as well. This one is coming in at about 42 pounds. And the lightweight door is coming in at around 20, 20 pounds. So that's near enough half the weight of the doors. This aluminium door skin's complete. I'm gonna do that process all over again on this door. And once I've done the two doors, I can move on to the boot lid and the bonnet. Thanks for watching today's video. Be sure to subscribe for future videos.